All right. As I scratch my ear there, hopefully my sound's fine. And hopefully you guys can hear background music, but you're not really going to be listening to that anyway. So, start this off. This is my first time doing some of these Legends of Rune Terra tutorials. Um, yeah, basically what we're going to do is we're going to try to follow the same format every single week, and then we'll upgrade from there. And that's how we're going to do it. This game's fairly new, you know what I mean? Like, I just got into it. And a lot of things I didn't know. Uh, we'll start off right in the beginning just by looking at these patch notes. You can check it out on their website. I might put a link in the description so you can really look at all of it. Um, and, yeah, you could either pause the video yourself just to kind of look at these, peruse through, see what things have been changed, added, updated. But, again, we're not going to go so deep into this because... Most of this is you can either view on the game or you can view it on their website specifically. But basically, what we're going to do is, you know, we get a lot of quests. Like, I got a quest today, just play rounds. It's fairly simple. You want, you're going to want to play all these quests. Quests give you XP to your um, specific race, I guess. Um, so, if I go to collections here and look at my decks... Actually, let's go to rewards. That's really what you see. You can change your region, you know, and it will. I finished most of these, so and it will. You activate the region, and the XP from the quest that you get will go into this. You will grab your reward, and that's how you do. I wish someone told me that because for a while I wasn't doing shit. So, anyway, uh, oh, rank will be disabled. So what we're gonna do is. They, there's a lot of quests that ask you to do specific things. So right now, I'm going to show you... What I'll do is I'll show you my build. And then we'll try it out in the game. And if it works, it works. If it doesn't work, it's still a solid build. I've used, I used it in Ranked. Like today, we're going to work on Demacia first. And a specific build with Demacia. I, li I like to call it Elites. So you'll see here in my section that uh, it's called Elites. So, I use it in ranked sometimes, but it's not amazing. It's actually pretty general. So, what we'll do is we'll actually look at it. All right. And edit deck. And I'll go over each one. Um, and then we'll, we'll play a game. But basically, you know, you always want this girl because think about it. She's one. She's got two, two, a health, two power, two health. It's great. This guy is the underlining factor of the whole deck. Yes, there's only three of him. I wish there were more, and there's other options I could use, but he really brings the deck together. It's him, so whenever you summon an elite, you grant it 1-1. One, one. So right up in the beginning, if you get these two, it's perfect. Like, you have such a great start because it pushes her to 3-3. Three, three. Say you get two of these, oh my gosh, 4-4 four, four, right off the back. Um, the other guy that works out beautifully, as you see here, it's all of the elites. So, literally, if you're wanting to build this, you want this guy mainly. Everything else is just elites like crazy. And you're gonna wanna, you're gonna want Vanguard Sergeant because he gives you the Four Demacia uh, spell, and that really helps out a lot. So, say for some reason, you cannot pull blacksmith which has happened to me a whole bunch make sure you get these vanguard sergeants out because they give you the four demacia and if you don't know what the four demacia is it's this it gives all allies three three one round and if you have a whole bunch of elites out you just bum rush your way through uh nothing else really complicated this guy i like that he's in here oh shit did i just delete that oh god um hold on one second I just got rid of you, and who else am I missing? My blacksmiths. Whew. And you. And who else? Who else am I missing? I think I. Yep, I took out one of him. Vanguard. Vanguard first blade is really cool, because what he does is he literally just buffs himself. I was surprised that I didn't have this guy in my deck beforehand. Let me stop messing with this. So. 
I'll leave this up here on the side. You can pause the video and if you want to go a little higher, again, you can pause the video and uh, get your build, you know, um, and let's use it. I only have one uh, uh, champion in here. I should have more. I could fix this build up a lot, and, 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 and definitely, too, if you guys think you can make this build even better, let me know, because then I'll add to this, and I'll show more videos on it. So, let's try it out. We're just going to do a normal. You don't want to... I just dropped some stuff all over the floor. You know, you never want to... You want to try it. My goal is, if I get three wins easy in regular, I bring it on to ranked. Yeah, I mean, so... So what I want, I don't even care about any of this. What I want, I will replace everything until I get that guy that I need. Alright, so I don't have. So this may not go too well. Who knows? If I lose this, you won't even see this anyway. <laughs> or maybe I'll just leave it up. So I'm not going to be able to do anything. He's going to hit me in the face. Ugh, that's the guy I want. And this actually works out perfectly because I really don't care what he's doing. So once he's out, that's where everything starts. Next round, I'm going to get three mana. Oh, Frostbite me. Oh, no. He can't attack anyway, so pass. I want that Vanguard Sergeant out, baby. That's what I want. Uh, yeah, screw it. Whatever. Let's buff him, and then we're going to attack. He's probably going to defend with something. I mean, he kind of looks like an ice, ice deck. You know... Rarely do you put this guy out. Don't even put the. Don't even put him out. You don't want him to die. Smart people kill him early. Of course, she's gonna defend with this, but I don't care. I've got, I've got. Oh, most of my deck is elites. That's all we care about. More elites we put out, more buffs they get. Cheap units seem amazing. I have four right now. Buff, buff. So from him seeing that, he's going to be like, I need to kill him. Oh, nice. Um, I'm not sure what she's about to do. But like hell, I'm going to let her continue. Yep, here go. Buff. Oh, Frostbite. All right, cool. That's fine. I had to. So as you're seeing now, you're seeing, you're seeing how this goes, right? Like, I put out units. By the way, I'm going to put him out last because he's going to buff everyone else. I put out units. They get scared. But like, what is your problem? He, he really doesn't want this attacking him, <laughs> which is fine. I don't care. What you're seeing is the annoyance. This girl's good because the more people you put out, makes her cost less. This is the last thing this girl wants, is for me to just keep popping out elites. And if she does not kill at least all of them, I'm going to use this. And that's fine. So we want some of these to die because we want this big guy out here and then we'll pop our four Demacia and hopefully we won by that time oh, I probably shouldn't have let that out but whatever I've committed we get a nice seven damage in sweet that's what we want what we don't want is this person to barrel roll that's what we don't want mmm this is perfect. Mm, I like to see two of these. So if she wants to try some slick shit. This is not good. Because I'm pretty sure that's two damage. That's two damage plus freezing. And we don't want that. So what we'll do is... I don't know if she's going to allow me to do this, but we'll see anyway. Screw it, we have nothing better to do. Huh? Frozen? Kill a unit. 
<laughs> That's so annoying. Alright. It's cool. Since she killed it, they weren't able to battle, so she wasn't able to attack with it. Which is perfect. I'm gonna throw... Uh, I should throw both of these out. Screw it, I'll play it slow. Oh no, you know what? <laughs> she does not want <laughs> any type of damage happening. If she was really good, she's going to follow up with another move that kills everything. If anyone has... Uh, I better be careful. She has enough mana. These uh, Freyords have a move that costs about 7. That if everyone has 0 attack... Uh, I think it's called like Windstorm, Ice Storm or something like that. It kills all the per people with 0 attack. So hopefully, I'm going to negate that by going like that. And it buffs them anyway, so whatever. Let's see. It's either that or she's going to play something else. Cool. I'm fine with that. And should I attack? I have a repost for no reason. If she blocks with this, that's fine. Let's see if I can bait her. I'm trying to bait her. That's what I want. Uh, <laughs> she's like, I'm not going to fall for that. That's fine, whatever. She almost fell for it, but she was like, I'm not falling for that. And that's cool. That's fine. <sighs> oh, but you see what I'm about to do right now? Alright, so she frosts. Let's see, how is she going to save her? I really want to see. Save her now. Beautiful. She couldn't. And that's beautiful. That's exactly what I want to see. I'll take the damage. Uh, actually, you know what? I'll defend this. Uh, make sure he has no move. Alright, cool. I'm fine with that. Because next round, I'm about to just unleash hell. I don't even care. Let's throw this out. So if anything important comes out, I'll just destroy it. Nice. I have no room for things anyway. She is mixed with... What is this? I forgot what that's named. But they don't have a cancel move, so this goes through. Overwhelm, that's fine. Um, yeah, fuck. Nah, we don't want him to kill this. And 13, that's enough damage to kill him. I think that's game. He's either going to surrender or do a miraculous move. Here comes the miraculous move. Drain. Gives him a little bit of life, but does that keep him alive? 19? It might. Doom, 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 doom. No, it doesn't. Good game. Beautiful. A little scary, but it works. Like I said, it, it really is just all about getting the blacksmith. You get the... You saw, I have one blacksmith there. Easy. One. Just one blacksmith. If I had three, imagine. Three and then the vanguard uh, girl that costs one. Put her out. She just turns into... What is that? She turns into 5-5. Five, five. Like that would be insane. So you basically get the idea. I'm going to try to do small tutorials like this. I hope you guys get the idea. Again, I'll show the build again. So you guys get it. It's basically the blacksmith... Any elite you want. I throw single combat in there. Because some people are really annoying. 
I also think I have... There's some people are really annoying that you just can't get to, and you need them dead. Like, Ash is one of them that needed to die. She she kept frost frosting everything, and that's annoying. So, um, I might actually take one of these Rupo saves out, right? And put in maybe a Detain. Yeah, yeah, I think I might do that. I'm going to put in Detain. Only reason why I say that is because we, as Demacia, you don't technically have a, a just kill a unit. So what I've learned with this deck is I lose a lot of the times that I don't... Um, Oh, that's another good thing that I should put in there. Reinforcements. I lose a lot of the times that I do not... Um, get rid of a certain unit. So, like, there are... I think it's Bridgewater. There's a couple units out there that can't die. Like, you kill them, they come back even stronger. And that's annoying. So, I'm going to leave that capture in there. Sometimes people like to go Fiora versus this deck. And just put all these buffs on her and you just can't kill her that's super annoying um yeah so i'll leave the detain in there and see how that works out again you guys can pause this uh if it helps you let me know how it goes uh you can also probably throw in reinforcements i don't know why i don't use that probably because it costs eight it's a really cheap deck look the max thing in here is garen which i only have one of so you know it's, it's really fast doesn't take a whole long time this deck is great first the stupid deep dive decks because you those decks are really strong later after they've tossed all their cards but this deck is instantly strong and i love that i hope you guys enjoy it let me know how it works out for you and if i can find another deck that's pretty good which i have a couple uh i'll show it to you and again in the comments or please let us know if you can make this deck better and I'll revamp this deck and we'll make an awesome easy haymaker deck I don't know if anyone gets that term all right see you guys later